I'm Amy from the Children's Museum of Sonoma County, and welcome to Storytime from My Tiny House on Wheels. Today we're going to read The Night Gardener by the Fan Brothers. William looked out his window to find a commotion on the street. He quickly dressed, ran downstairs, and raced out the door. The wise owl had appeared overnight as if by magic. William spent the whole day staring at it in wonder. And he continued to stare until it became too dark to see. That night, he went to sleep with a sense of excitement. The following morning, William was not disappointed. Each day, William discovered a new topiary. Next was a friendly rabbit, followed by a pretty parakeet. And then a playful elephant. With each new sculpture, the crowds grew and grew. Something was happening on Grimlock Lane. Something good. The next day, William dashed out of his home and followed the crowds only to find the most magnificent masterpiece yet. Festivities continued long after the sun had set. As William was about to head home, He spotted someone unfamiliar. <gasps> Could it be? The gentleman turned to William. There are so many trees in this park. I could use a little help. It was the night gardener. Under the light of the full moon, they worked deep into the night. William awoke to the sound of happy families walking by, and a gift from the night gardener. The whole town had come out to admire the night gardener's and William's hard work. Over time, the leaves changed and then fell until there was no evidence that the night gardener had ever been to Grimlock Lane. But the people of the small town were never the same. And neither was William. Thanks for joining us. See you next time as we read more books from My Tiny House.